Sales is fun. Ask anyone with a rewarding sales career and they will tell you that sales is really fun. It's great. Now, selling is real hard and not fun at all for people who take themselves too seriously. Now, selling is real hard if you take everything personally. And selling is real hard if you go through your sales career without the sense of humor. You see, because sales is not about selling. Yes, it's what you do. Yes, it's the work that you churn out every day. But selling is not about sales. Selling is about making people happy. Selling is about solving other people's problems. Selling is about making someone else's life better. So you know what? Learn how to have fun because sales, selling is a very fun career. Now, here's how we can have some fun at work. Well, number one, surprise your customers. That's right. Have you ever surprised a friend for his birthday? Now that was fun, isn't it? Now, you can do the same for your customers. Well, maybe not the birthday. Well, maybe it could be the birthday. Okay, make them happy. Call them on their birthday. Okay, send them something surprising. Include them inside your favorite activities. They're like, oh, no, hey, now I'm going to play badminton on Thursday. You want to come along? Surprise! Because no other salesperson will ever do that. Okay? So if you get a Facebook update, let's say you've updated his Facebook, say, no, I've got a new baby. Guess what? Call him, visit him. Do whatever you can. Care. What you want to do is you want to surprise your customers. And if you surprise your customers, they become happy. And when they are happy, you are happy okay how to have fun number two on the phone just pretend he's your friend okay on the phone don't be you know, this, this really dude, i don't know what it's gonna say and don't be stiff okay pretend he's your friend and of course you know having said that if you curse to your friends a lot don't curse to your customers okay don't treat them like that kind of friend uh, be professional of course but if let's say the person on the other line picks up your phone and says Yes. Now, I did this once before. I asked the customer, hey, um, you sound like you're having a bad day. Is everything okay? That's right. So you can have fun with this. Okay? Do something you haven't done before. Number three, do something unique, special. You haven't done this before. Like, for example, ah, I sent a shoe. That's right. I, I sent a shoe. I'm, uh, no, shoe. Shoe. Uh, there's a foot, not a shoe, but you know, I sent a shoe. And why did I send a shoe? Because I, I couldn't, I couldn't meet this guy. I mean, everything I tried to do, he just wouldn't see me. He totally refused to. And so after months of trying, I, I finally went to the um, supermarket. I bought a uh, pair of baby shoes. I took one shoe and I wrapped it up uh, with a note inside and sent it to him. And so he receives this uh, packaged, a package, opens it up, finds a shoe inside with a note saying, you know, I just like to get a foot in the door. And you know what? He called me. And I got an appointment with him the week after. So, guys, you can have a lot of fun with these things. If people are not talking to you, if they're not uh, answering your calls, you can have lots of fun. I'll give you another example. Um, do something you haven't done before. Uh, leave a voicemail. Uh, a halfway voicemail. Uh, that says something like, Hey, John! You know what? I, I was with your friend the other day and we were talking about you and he said, and you hang up. <laughs> They'll get them curious. So do something you haven't done before. Um, do something special. Do something uh, interesting. Have fun with this, okay? And number four, here, how to have fun. I think learning is fun. I think learning is very fun. And uh, for us salespeople, uh, one of the most boring parts of our job is driving from A to B. Uh, driving to meet customer, the first customer, driving the other town to the other side of the town to meet the second customer, and so it's a drag. So what you can do is you can pop CDs in your car, uh, not not just music CDs, but learning CDs, um, learning everything from how to sell, how to handle objections, uh, any personal development stuff. And many times, when I do that, when I pop CDs or when I listen to MP3s about uh, learning things, but by the time I get out of the car. I have all these ideas in my head and I'm raring to go. So guys, learn to have fun.
you like it.